what's up youtube i'm back again okay so i went and got this because i'm gonna drain my motherfucking transmission i want to make sure that the cable's right i got the cable on there i never dropped the pin to make sure that the uh that it was engaging all the way at full throttle the governor or whatever so i'm gonna have to drop it and check it right now so i figure what better day than today i ain't got shit going on so bear with me people we're gonna do this Put some content on the channel like subscribe let me know what you think i'll be back guys it's a tight squeeze in between my car and the wall so i got the jack in here i'm trying to jack it up there's my transmission we're gonna jack it up we're gonna crack the uh, drain and we're gonna let it drain out for a while we'll come back later i'm gonna get a better video when i jack it up all right guys here's my uh transmission pan i gotta go get this size i don't know what size that is i gotta get that and uh i can crack this bitch open and see i can drop the pan and then we can see what's going on with the uh cable all right what's up guys i jacked the car up i dropped the plug so right now it's draining I'm gonna let it drain overnight. I'm gonna drop the pan tomorrow. We're gonna adjust that cable, make sure it's uh, fully engaged at full throttle, and we're gonna see what's up. I'll be back later. YouTube, I got the fluid drained. I gotta give rid of this dirt, this little dirt corner out of my fucking garage. I gotta shovel that out. But um, as you see, I got the poor Square National owner jack stands. How you like them apples? I gotta put the molding back around my fender. I got, I took them off. They're sitting in my bedroom when I was doing something before but anyway yeah so I got it up in the air I'm about to drop the pan right now I'm gonna let you guys know what I see and off letting the excess drip a uh, few more minutes I'll be back to make sure that this is um to see if this is engaging all the way or not all right guys under the transmission we got to make sure that this fully engages and we gotta do that while making sure that we try to have the cable as loose as possible. Loose is towards the radiator and tight is towards the firewall. So you wanna back the cable out as far towards the radiator as you can while still getting this to engage at full throttle. So, hey Ma, hit the pedal. See, it's going all the way in. I fiddled with it back and forth. All right, you can let it go. I fiddled with it back and forth. I got it right there. And I think it should be perfect. Now I'm gonna bolt everything back up, take it for a spin. All right, guys, the car's all back together. It took me a little while, you know, it took my time, though. And uh, the cable was a little bit tight. <clears throat> so now that it's adjusted, I'm going to take it for a spin and we're going to see how much better it feels because it was definitely a little bit too tight. So I'll be back in a minute and let y'all know. Okay, people, I took the car out. Feels much better. Feels a lot better, actually. And, yeah, I'm so glad I did that. So now that I know that that valve is fully engaged when the when the uh, pedal is at full throttle i'm all set i got a peace of mind i don't got to worry about it no more and more importantly i am done with this nightmare transmission i can go on to the next and uh yeah let me know what you people think you know like comment whatever you want subscribe if you want but i like when you guys comment let me know what you're doing with your cars what's up what should i do what do you think come on man give me the input grand national guys regal guys let me know what's up